And this is the last question from problem set 5, the mixed strategy naturally equivalent problem set. So it's just to let you practice writing down the indifference condition for more than two queries. The numbers here, I use one third is not a good number after I write the answer. So, so the numbers are not important. So the main idea is how to write down the indifference condition. The idea is always the same. The first step is always make assumption of the other player's mixing prob probabilities. Since it's symmetric, they use the same mixing probability. So the probability of player both 2 and 3 playing S will be equal to alpha, say, and the probability of both of them playing no, no will be 1 minus alpha. So given this assumption, I can always calculate the payoff for me from sending and not sending. So I can have a payoff like this too. So not sending gives me a third as giving the question the probability from sending depends on what the other people are choosing. So the first case is the other people are both choose to send. If I send then it becomes SSS, then my probability of get, getting rescued becomes 1 over 3. And this event happening is with probability alpha times alpha, which is this. And the second one is as so I, I always send and the say the second player still sends and last player does not send and I get rescued with probably a half which is my utility and this event happens with probability this and similarly I can get S and S which is still I get rescued with probability a half that event happens with this probability and the last one is S and N so remember I always play S so that I get rescued was probably one, and that event happens with probability this. So then we can write the indifference condition, which is just simply uh, these two are equal to each other. So let's simplify it a bit. So this plus half. So there are two halves. So it becomes one times alpha one minus alpha plus one alpha squared, and this is equal to a third. So solving this gives me alpha equal to 1, which means this already implies there is no mixed strategy in Ash equivalent that's symmetric. Because as you saw, if this happens, indifference method doesn't work. It means that there is no, no Nash equivalent where both of the people mix with the same probability. So we can conclude that. Then we can find the purest strategy once there are only two possibilities, SSS or NNN. Given and, and obviously everyone will want to deviate to play S, so this is not a Nash, so this is the only one that Nash that's symmetric. So the important thing again is how to write down this condition instead of actually solving this whole problem. So remember in the lecture slides I have one sum with combinatorics. So that one is the same as mm, this idea. So it's basically we have two true zero which is from two people, I choose no people to not, I mean, to choose two is a better expression. So two people, we choose both of them to send a signal and the probability squared plus half times two choose one. So one of them, two choose one means there are two people, they are either SN or NS. We, we choose which one to send a signal times alpha, so the probability of send and one minus alpha, both of them to the power one. And the last one is 1, 2, true, 0. So no one is sending. And this is, say, alpha to the power 0, 1 minus alpha to the power 2. So if you express it this way, then you can see how in the lecture slides, what that, that sum combinatoric stuff came from. But in any case, it's just this basic idea. We figure out in with each situation was my payoff, and we compute the probability of that situation happening given this assumption of the other players' mixing, mixing probabilities.